Hi guys, welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to share with you our latest design on BMW i3 battery pack. As you can see, this is our upgrade solution. We use four brand new modules replace eight old ones. And when BMW designed their battery pack, they use their battery module as a part of the structural component to support the weight of itself. We follow the same design concept. We use one, two, three, four, five. We use five reinforced connector to connecting our four module. As a comparison, I put original BMW connector here. You can see our connector is much bigger than the original one. This one as well. You can clearly see the difference between them. Besides that, we leave enough rooms inside the battery compartment. These rooms inside the battery compartment can guarantee the safety during the car accident. If there is a crash, this battery compartment may deformation and the rooms inside make sure the deformation will not damage the battery cells. This is very important. It can guarantee the safety during the accident. Except the five reinforced connector, our mechanical engineer still think the reinforcement is not enough. So he specially designed a stiffener for this uh, battery pack. This stiffener is made by special aluminum, which is very light, but also very strong. We will put it on the middle of the battery pack, as you can see here. This stiffener can reinforce the strength of this battery pack dramatically. And uh, also, I will prepare a test. I will prepare a small test today to show you the capability of this uh, stiffener. Hi, everyone. In order to test the strength of our stiffener, we specially prepared this laser sensor. This sensor using the laser triangulation measurement technology. With this technology, this sensor can reach 0.01 millimeters repeat accuracy, which is very, very good. We will put the laser spot on the top of this stiffener. We will add some load to this stiffener, simulate the working environment in the battery compartment. Then we will see how the bar, the stiffener, deformed and how it reacts. Okay guys, now we will prepare to test the strength of the stiffener. We use the forklift to, le to lift the stiffener and we put two spacer under the stiffener. So these two spacer will support the stiffener. In the middle, we put the weight on the middle. This is the uh, original Nissan Leaf battery compartment. It weighs around 50 kilograms. And those older batteries, we use it as a weight. Each of them weighs around 33 kilograms. So, total weight of this uh, package is around 180, something like that. Now, indicator show that the display show the position of the top is around uh, 0 0.4 something. Okay, now we prepare to leave the whole package and see the displacement on the stiffener. Oh. Okay, you can see now the package is leave the ground and the displacement here is around three. So. The total deformation in the middle of the stiffener is around 2.5, 2.6, something like that. And this weight, 180 kilograms, is very, very heavy because we will install this stiffener only in the middle. It will not support the whole weight of the entire package. So this proves our stiffener works and the strength is good enough. 